going on people welcome back to the channel 2019 team sword you to the world hi guys happy new year happy, happy new year, year. <clears throat> yeah happy new year yeah 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 uh -huh. no joke <laughs> how yeah. are you guys what's going on man it's been a minute i like it's been an hour that was funny <laughs> Hi guys! <laughs> oh, go on, popcorn! Nah, no, no, guys. Jacob. Yeah, man. It's been real. And if you follow us on Instagram, you know it's been <laughs> real, real. <laughs> if you know what I mean. For those that don't follow us on Instagram, we're having a second baby. The team is getting stronger. Expansion. I can't be able to get up, guys. I'm tired. And yeah. Don't worry. If you want to see the pictures, just go on our Instagram socials and you see them. You know. Yeah, we're six months pregnant, wow. and um, six yeah. months. Pregnant. Well, we give thanks. Six pregnant. months pregnant we are, by the grace of God, and um, yeah, man, it's things have been like in terms of pregnancy, things have been good. I can't complain. No, oh, give thanks, like seriously. We give thanks, man. It's been a interesting 2018 but 2019 is gonna be a spectacular year yeah you know a year of breakthrough amen doors opening amen greatness from team sword you are individually amen. as a unit as well we got, we got a lot planned i feel like this year we're a lot more structured and planned mm. than what we're what we want to do what we're going to do what we are doing our direction our vision our goal yeah and um, that's really good and what I like, well, what I like is the fact that we kept it biblical, if that makes sense. So we stuck to the word, we wrote the vision down, we made it plain, you know, and we're gonna execute it. And those, those of you that follow us on Twitter, <laughs> it's so not even funny, but I love the fact that that's probably been our highest tweet. And it's um, the word for this year, surely, is consistency. Yeah. And it got retweets. So yeah, guys, we're gonna be consistent, and that's our yeah. accountability to each other. I feel like 2018 was um, an up and down year. Mm. I think it was probably the most trying year since we've been married. Yeah. Um, For real. Trying because there was a lot of hurdles. Um, not necessarily in our marriage, just like in life. Yeah. For real. And then I think it definitely got us. I think it's got we've gotten closer. Mm, yeah, no, yeah, for real. A lot closer. He gets on my nerves every day, and I feel like I hate him every day. But you know, I'm emotional. I'm not emotional. I'm hormonal. So he be saying things that get on my nerves and hurting my heart. The other day, I told him I went to bed. <laughs> I went to nap. Yeah. And now, what did I say to you when I woke up? I can't remember. You went to bed with a heavy heart. Yeah, I said I went to bed with a heavy heart. And he was like, did you just <laughs> no, like, like, I'm laughing, but at the time, it was not funny. I don't know what he said to me. I can't but even I said, remember. He said something, and I went to sleep thinking about it. I went, didn't go to sleep. I went to have a nap mm. thinking about it. And I woke up, and what, he said something to me, and I was like, well, I don't care. And I was like, you don't mean that, because if you did, when you said what you said earlier, I was like, I went to sleep with a heavy heart. And he was looking at me for long, like, this girl's so dramatic. And I was just thinking, well, everyone's words carry weight, doesn't it? But you know what, guys? In my defence, yeah. So <clears throat> we've been watching this show. What show? Something called Broken Silence. But I can't remember the name of the show. It, when I explain, Mrs. will get it. Okay. So you know, she likes to watch a lot of that TV, like reality stuff, and it won't. But so one thing that was said, and it, I, it stuck with me. You know, sometimes you may not agree, you may not think Mrs. is right, but for the fact, but for the shit fact, she's annoyed and upset. Like you know what? It's not my intention to upset you, but for the fact that it upsets you. You look to see my face is twitching for already. The fact it upsets you. What program I'm did sorry. you learn that from? Because Pastor counseled us in yes, 2012. Yes, that as well. But it's good to have a refresher. In a refresh. oh and God. told us. Yeah, I know. We don't go to sleep on the, on the anger business. That's, and she said, sometimes you don't intend to hurt someone. Just because our of intention course. is not Hold to on. hurt someone or offend someone doesn't mean that we don't end up hurting them. Um, and that's what I'm alluding to. So what, you only learned that the other day on the reality okay. TV show? Let me rephrase. No, not even rephrase. It was a reminder. Oh, okay. You know, sometimes you need a reminder. 
and there's nothing wrong in a reminder. That's you didn't right. apologize though, so I don't know. You like, don't listen to EJ, he's a fraud. I'm not a fraud, bae. <laughs> 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 yeah. Oh, um, but yeah, um, oh. yeah, man, 2018 has been a lot and then out of the blue it was like boom we found out we're pregnant and we were yeah. so confused but well, i was really confused dj was happy of course trapping but yeah um yeah i was confused man and then it took me so long to grasp the fact that i was having another baby even the other day someone was like swords you're having a baby and i was like i'm having a baby so again a baby. and it means so much to me but yeah man i've really been thinking about you know um um like having kids within your marriage and the covenant that it is and just you know i've been thinking about it deeply and i'm i'm thankful man i'm grateful i'm happy more than anything at first i was so discombobulated and confused of course understandable but once i was like once i got it in my head like okay you're having another baby i was happy because i know it's a blessing period and I stopped questioning my hows and whens and whys mm. and and just started being like, this is going to be amazing. And it's so funny because I don't know if it's because I've already had a, uh, um, carried a baby before, but this time I just feel like I've got such a connection with this baby. And I'm so in love with it already. And yeah, it's really active. It's way more active than Nova. And I'm just like, wow, if this is a boy, it's a footballer. Just Top bins, left, pew, right, pew, right. Pew, pew, pew. Be better than me. <laughs> yeah. You might too. So yeah. Oh. Um, <laughs> but you always, <laughs> no, but you always say that you're not the greatest footballer because you're a science man. But you like watching it. I love watching. Yeah, he always says that. <laughs> That's fine. But yeah, no, I don't mind. <clears throat> but yeah, guys, I do give thanks because obviously, you know, I've got a second one on the way. The relationship gets stronger as much as. She annoys me and I annoy her. But that's just how it goes. EJ it. absolutely loves me, guys. I'm not going to lie to she you. She absolutely loves me. Yeah, I like him. But <laughs> he like, is so mean to me. He's so rude to me. <laughs> Bruh, and he's coming to spill bare tea and that. Are you getting me? my feelings, yeah. But then he's so obsessed with me. I'm just like, bro, let me have a break. It's, hey. Let me have some space. Yeah. Like, chill out. Yeah, I'm joking. No, yeah. like, who does that? He loves me. I'm not going to lie. Ask around. Ask his friend. <laughs> <laughs> what? Ask my friends. He really loves me. I'm just like, oh, calm down, calm down. There's enough of me to go round. He really loves me, babe. Babe, is that a uh, silver hair? Yes, I have a silver hair. Wait, there, I want to see that. So we're doing this live on YouTube. Wait, guys. Yes, I have or a silver. Or is it fluff? Because it looks like it's coming out of your eye socket. Well, I do have one. No. Yeah, I do. Guy, um, guys, oh. EJ's a kitten. Why do you have one white hair coming out of here? <laughs> yeah, I've had that for... Everyone's like, wow, EJ, you got one. I'm like, yeah. But why is it here? I don't know. Can I pull it? She must. <laughs> Maybe that was just fluff. No, it was. It was fluff. No, it was. It was a hair. Yeah. Well? Make a wish. <laughs> I'm wise. <laughs> but guys, honestly, for 2019, time to get serious. You ever write, written down your visions and your goals? Yeah, guys. I really suggest you do that. You know, make it as very thorough. Break it down to the T. You know, what do you want to achieve? You know, what do you want to actually set out to do? Yeah. And regarding what you want to achieve, don't be afraid. Literally, if it doesn't scare you, then it's not big enough for you. Definitely that makes not. sense. But if it makes you feel, ooh, I'm not sure about that, then you're on the right path. That's yeah. what I want to say. Even for me, like literally the goals, the visions that I have, I don't believe in resolutions, don't really want for that. Because I just, yeah. But I'm, a f <laughs> I'm just a firm believer in that, you know, whatever you set out to achieve, you can achieve it. You know, people may look at you like you're mad, like you're crazy, like you're insane. But then when it happens for you, everyone's like, yeah, like man was dead, you know, in the background, so cheering you on. Mm. Like your gems, but that's a whole different story. Wow. Wow, keep it real. But. Yeah, just add structure, literally, in this every single day. Make sure you do something step by step you know, yeah. to get to what you need to get to. Like what EJ said, something I've been doing already, I've put into place, I have an ac accountability partner. Of course, I'm accountable to EJ, not because he's my husband, because we discuss certain things that we want to do, so I'm now accountable <coughs> to him. 
and he's accountable to me. Sometimes. I know how to get. I'm, look, I know how to work up. Look, 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 look. I'm worked up. I'm very Jesus. cheerful. Cheers. That's it. Woman of God anointed. Anyway. That's it. So I've Leah, got an account. Woman of God. You all wind up. That's why you got white hairs growing out your eye. <laughs> anyway. I got an accountability partner. And in the week, we've got seven days. So we make five targets to fulfill in that week. Yeah, it could be something so small. Like, um, I need to tidy up my whole room and put everything in structure. I need to contact this company. I need to send this letter. I need to send that email. Just five things. And um, we started doing that. And for me, it's working out for my good. Because, you know, there's many things that I say I want to do. But sometimes if we talk and there's no action behind it, it falls on deaf ears and it just doesn't manifest. So I'm trying to, even if it's in my notes on my phone, I'll write out little targets that I want to do in the week. And before you know it, after a month, you've completed all these tasks and you're that step closer to your entire vision. So you might as well get yourself an accountability partner, whether it's your sibling, your friend, your cousin, your partner, you know, someone that's going to really pull you up and you're going to respect it. You're not going to try and attack them if they pull you up for not being or doing what you're saying you're supposed to be doing. Um, yeah, and yeah, that's what I think everyone should start their year off doing and continue their year doing. I can't lie. Sometimes, as painful as it sounds, the harsh truth is the best truth. Mm-hmm. You know, if you want to do well in whatever environment is you want to do well in, sometimes you need that painful truth, you know, Yeah. to do well isn't going to be easy yeah you know, otherwise everyone will be doing well but everyone's not doing well so you just got to put in that time and effort <coughs> to make it happen yeah but yeah guys i mean that's what we're doing so far i've even started doing little targets for nova nova is one and five months she'll be one and six months at the end of january or middle of january the 19th um so she's growing up that's at the end that's in a couple of days low key but wow but yeah i mean time's ticking just like that she's so clever so friendly so infectious and she's so beautiful and yeah i'm gonna get her on here one day when she hasn't got too much of him because she's an energizer bunny when she's at home uh she's in in bed right now of course but yeah uh, that's a sort of life update really yeah I, i'm i'm in the salon still guys i'm just not there as much as i used to be because the difference <clears throat> between this pregnancy and nova's pregnancy is that i'm so exhausted with nova's i was like yeah give me that energy 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 now and i just yeah. had energy i don't know this one, I'm not saying I don't have energy, but I'm, I am I get tired. And when I'm tired, it's like my whole body wants to shut down and relax and replenish. And I'm all good with that. Like, so I have like a nap a day at least. And EJ steps in when I'm having my nap. Um, yeah. What else? Um. We don't know what we're having. Again, we didn't find out. So you guys, I guess, are going to let me know eventually if I'm having a boy or girl. Because all of you seem to be God. All of you seem to be God. Well, guys. All of you seem to know. I've already got people telling me that they. Oh, I knew you were pregnant. I'm just like prayers oh, and fasting. Oh, are you part? Bring forth revelation. Are you part of my uterus? No, I'm joking. Everyone's always saying they know what they knew. I mean, it can only be a boy or a girl, guys. So some of you are going to be right. Some of you are going to be wrong. You know. Um, ninety nine percent of people, or probably ninety four percent, have told me that I'm having a boy. Um, I don't really mind what I'm having. As long as God says is, that's what will be. Happy, healthy, beautiful, and I'm happy too. Amen. Literally. <clears throat> that's what um, it Yeah, man. That's an update, really. I'm trying to think what else. Ah, guys. I'm already speaking it right now. So you have to We're hold having us accountable. An event. Yes. Last we... year, we promised. And guys, it didn't come to fruition. I'm not even going to talk about that one. I'm saying this one. 2019 first quarter yeah there's four quarters in a year so first quarter i'm not gonna say what month Ooh. because i can really embarrass myself but we're doing team swatch world event you've yes, seen it are. here and there first if you'd like to attend say i and in the comments down make below. sure guys man because we always say try and interact with you guys and some of you will just be like oh you look so beautiful 
or your makeup they're just like hello we asked you like 10 questions come on now answer us see what videos do you guys want to see this year Bruh. this year me and ej are on one accord mm. god has really um put us in a position where i think our visions are very similar um so we're more of one accord than we were last year so there won't be no head bumping i'm accountable to him when it comes to shooting videos even when mm. i'm tired i'm still gonna do it because i told him that i'm gonna you know do what? it that's a video in itself and i'm being actually. a woman of my word no no no, no. what is about how we you know stopped to bump the heads and said let's be aligned I like being too. No, I'm joking. <laughs> look, 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 look. I'm look. joking. I'm joking. But I'm no, joking. Seriously, that's a that's a video about you know. I don't know what the struggles. No, the realness of marriage. Yeah, yeah. You don't know. I'm ready mm. for all the realness, boy. I've got so true. much that I want to discuss this year in terms of relationship. Mm. I'm, I'm literally. We're gonna have our first relationship um seminar event, and it's coming real soon. I'm, I'm structuring some stuff. So this one is not talk, it's doing. So again, if you would like to attend that, comment down below. Yeah. And number two, guys. No, I don't lose my mind. You didn't lose your mind, you lost your foot. I lost my foot. That's okay. You said relationship seminar. And number two. I don't even know. But <clears throat> regarding that, comment down below if you want to attend. That's it, it's going to be in London. I that one. Oh yeah, of course. I know we've, we've got you know supporters. You know the the squad you was, the squad, That's what I call you. The squad you was. You like that? The two squad you was, the squad You guys kept on pulling up squad you was, So I think it's just stuck now. Yeah. Like even on my Instagram pictures, some people will be like, "Oh my god, you look so nice, squad you was. And I'm like, "Do you like know that my name's Swade?" Like. I know. So you. Guys, I don't know. Did you know my name was Swade, guys? Comment down below. Let me know. <laughs> because people message me sometimes. They're like, "Hi, squad you was. And I'm like, "Huh?" I'm like, you know, it's just me you're talking to. It's just Swade. I don't know if you lot think that's my name. I'm Swade, he's Emmanuel, EJ to you guys. Emmanuel to me, his wife. Together, Swad, you well. Well, if I'm at work, they don't want to call me Jamie or EJ, you know what I mean? They call me Emmanuel. They better, because they ain't your wife. No, I'm joking. <laughs> but yeah. I'm no. joking, guys. So, I guess, I'm ready to close the summary. Yeah, So, in summary, guys, Team Swad, you well. I'm not going to say it's back. It's, we were never gone. We were never gone. We weren't gone, we were figuring mm. ourselves out. <clears throat> Sometimes you have to take a moment, step back, figure yourself mm, out before it. you come and present that yourself is it. again. That is it. I promise you, if we continue just shooting videos and releasing them last year, it would have been... You wouldn't have enjoyed it and it wouldn't have been, mm. you know... Do you know what? It's just, I know it's fun, not even funny, but how can they enjoy it if we don't enjoy it? Right, and at the time, remember I said I wasn't enjoying it. Not because I didn't enjoy the process. I weren't enjoying the whole thinking hard about what I want to talk about. I need it to flow naturally from God to me to you, you know, or the message won't be delivered properly. So, yeah, I just want to thank you guys for all hanging in there. I see that our subscribers are still going up slowly but surely. And to me, that's amazing. I get people DMing me, emailing us about our videos and the content and how much it's changing and i'm just like oh we're not even putting things out right now but uh thank you guys just i'm really humbled thank you so much and if you saw my eyes twitching i thought i heard another door open but anyways <clears throat> back to what i was going to say in our summary so team store draw events look out for that so these are going to be relationships empowerment tips guides hauls all types of advice for you guys i can't wait for it but really really excited about that one because i love to do events and to do an event with my business partner best friend and wife i can't wait for it again yeah, told you guys obsession he loves me yeah because in the words of jay-z what's better than one millionaire two what is that got to do with your obsession with because me? the one millionaire is him the second millionaire is his wife bow are you getting me so he's still obsessed you are. yeah i have to be obsessed unless you want to go obsessed with Hillary or someone else. You wouldn't even allow yourself. Amen. Hallelujah. Pray over me. Yeah, me. Well, but God, <laughs> to God. of course. But God still, will send some still, fire. still pray for me. But no, anyways. So Teen Squad Your Events, small videos, just being us, small vlogs, mm -hmm. you know what we do together, our businesses, obviously that we're doing and setting up as well. We'll be doing the blogging stuff, the fashion blogging. So guys, if you're on the gram, check us out. I'm not gonna beg for the follow. We don't gonna beg for that. But if you wanna follow and keep up to date, just follow. You got me though. 
that name is spelled five and number five. But anyways. I cannot. <laughs> anyway, guys, have a great Yeah, have a great evening. day, evening, whatever. Time Follow at us, interact with us. This year is a year of interaction. I don't want no more dormant subscribers that aren't liking or not commenting come on let's be one we need to interact with each other so i can talk to you you can talk to me i don't like that whole like oh when people see me on the street for example and they're like oh my god and it's awkward we're meant to be like oh my gosh and be like oh yeah remember that time because i'll get that message and i said oh yeah i'll message you back i want it to be like that so let's get personal this year mm. and let's continue to build our brother and sisterhood and our familyhood and our squad jewelhood and if you still got relationship dilemmas, feel free to email them into us and we will do videos if it's okay. Yes, guys, this has been very informative. But yeah. Hope you enjoyed it. Hope you enjoyed this chapter. Mm -hmm.